crazy is that? I'm getting ready to take a picture. I'm getting ready to take a picture. Hey, God, you guys. Yes, we did it. 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 Hello and welcome back to another video with me, Elite Josie. And joining me today on this special is the 1K Q&A face reveal. And guys, thank you so much. You saw the clip there from last night's stream. We managed to reach 1,000 subscribers. It's all because of you guys. I can't thank you guys enough just for you guys always being there every night when we stream down in the comments and videos you guys are just the best so yeah guys this is my face i hope you don't mind it hopefully be nice down in the comments but anyway guys we've got loads of questions to get through so let's get started so the first question is from kayla and it says what are your future plans if you become a big youtuber also congrats on 1k thank you very much kayla congratulate me there and also big youtuber i i don't know i mean my plans I don't, one, I don't think I've become a big YouTuber, I think I like being a small channel because I'm able to interact with you guys quite easily like now in Q&As and in live streams and things like that, it's just really easy to do um, and good to talk to you guys because that's the best bit about it and my future plans would be exactly what we're doing now, live streaming, videos, content like this, uh, just having fun and talking to you guys, the subscribers, which is awesome. So Kayla also asked, did you think you'd be able to hit 1k when you first started YouTube? And my answer to that is no, I didn't. My first goal um, for YouTube really was to try and get 100 subscribers. That's what I just said to my friends. I was like, oh, it'd be awesome if I could get 100 subscribers. And we did it. And then now we're here now and it's just... It's pretty cool, and thank you so much, guys. Once again, I really appreciate it. So, Tumsy asks, nudes at 2k? Um, well... It's got it's got three likes. I, I I guess I have to do it then. So Neutron asks, congrats on 1K. What videos should people be expect from you in the future? By the way, nice face. Thank you very much, Neutron, for the nice comments on my face. And thank you for uh, saying uh, the 1K as well. But what videos for the future? Um, stuff like this. I quite enjoy doing videos like this. I found out while sorting out all these face cam stuff. I quite enjoy it. I find this quite fun, and it's good to be able to talk to you guys now face to face almost, or face to text. I don't know. Do you know, do you know what I mean? I, I quite enjoy this sort of stuff, so uh, I'm looking forward to doing more stuff like this. But don't worry, Minecraft's not going anywhere. I do enjoy playing Minecraft and streams and stuff. They will have face cam on now, so look forward to that in the streams too. So Majestic asks, why am I here? Um, I don't know. So Dennis asks, will your boy Jozzy ever do a modded series? And what are your opinion on the declining MC's popularity lately and Minecraft in general? Now, with the modded series thing, I did try and do a modded uh, stream when I was on the round 200 subscribers. Um, I basically streamed that because I wanted to get better at modded survival. It's just like we've been streaming Bed Wars at the moment because I want to improve at getting better at Bed Wars. So I'm, I'm terrible at PvP. You guys know if you've been watching Channel while, I am so bad. Um, but yeah, definitely modded series. I tried to stream for a while to improve and modded. And I, I just really struggle with it. I improved a little bit, but I'm still mega confused. I can never remember the crafting recipes. That's where I'm always stuck. Um, so potentially, probably it'd be on a live stream though, rather than in an actual series. Um, and what's your opinion on Decline MC's popularity? Um, it has declined the past couple of years. You know, you see people like Sky's Minecraft not doing as well and things like that. Um, and Minecraft in general, I love Minecraft. I, I really enjoy playing Minecraft because see, my whole channel's Minecraft. I really enjoy doing all the redstone and stuff. So with the decline in Minecraft's popularity, yes, it's declining, but there's still a massive community there um, of people who still support it, still enjoy the content. Like when we do our redstone stuff and things like that, you guys love it. And on the live streams, you guys love coming and joining. It's a great game because you guys can come and join in the fun of the live streams, which is the best bit. So Tex asks, when's this COD thing happening? Hey, COD, well, as you know, my channel is primarily more Minecraft based, but you know, I do enjoy playing games other than Minecraft. Minecraft isn't the only game I play, but on live streams is when I tend to play other different games like COD. I've streamed COD with you actually, Tex, and um, one of my live streams. We streamed GTA the other day. Uh, you know, we stream different games on the live streams, and I try and keep the recording to uh, like Minecraft kind of based. So, Tomsey asks, will you ever do a tour of your green gaming setup? Well, well done for noticing that it's a green. Um, but yeah, potentially, yeah, if anyone wants to see that down in the comments, please let me know, and uh, maybe we can make that happen. So, Tumsy asks, where do you live? So guys, I wasn't planning on showing you this, but here you go, Tumsy, this is where I live. So here we go, this is where I live, just in this little tunnel here. You can see, it's got everything I need in it. It's got a bed, it's got a chest, you know, in the chest we've got a load of food, that's, that's everything. We've got torches, and I've even got a lovely view. If we hop over here, I think I've also got a lovely lake I can peer at. Yeah, look at that, look how cool that looks. So the next question again is from Tumsy, and he asks, Will you do vloggy type videos or just MC videos with your face cam from now 
out on. So, like I said, Minecraft will not be going anywhere. Uh, the Redstone tutorials probably won't have a face cam on, and just because they're like tutorials. Uh, but the streams, the Minecraft streams, and any game streams will have face cam on. And yeah, we are going to be vlogging it in Insomnia. So, if you any of you guys go into uh, i60 here in the UK, it's a week on Sunday that's coming up. I think it's the 15th of April, I'm not too sure on that date. But um, yeah, I shall be vlogging that, and I'll be going down with uh, Neutron. I'm going to be going down, recording some cool content, and also vlogging it for you guys. So you guys can be there as well. So it's going to be cool. So yeah, some vloggy sort of content coming. Nan with a pan asks, "What came in the mail today?" Um, nothing. I, I don't really get much mail. Hello, darkness, my old Fire Jedi asks, "Can you make a diss track on Tumsy?" It's Mr. Tumble. Mr. Tumble. <laughs> oh gosh. I'm only joking, Agra. Please don't kill me. So, Bub the Epic asks, What is your favourite movie? So, my favourite, I don't really have really a favourite film as such, but probably the film that's made the most emotional in that sense, I guess, is uh, Toy Story 3. <laughs> I don't think you're expecting that, but yeah, Toy Story 3, that's the first film I've ever cried at, and still the film I cried the most at while watching. Um, they, they, there was no need for Andy to give them toys away at the end. I'm not going to get into it because I did this on a live stream and boy, oh gosh, didn't go well. So Shabibs asked, on a scale from 1 to 10, how nervous are you right now? Um, probably about 20 if I'm honest. It's, it's, it's a pretty nerve-wracking thing because you guys, for, you know, for so long, this channel is you know, up to 1,040 odd subscribers now. You guys have just had a voice and it's like reading a book. You guys have all got your own interpretations of what I should look like to you. Um, just from the voice, so it's like when people read a book to you, you all think of what the character looks like, but you don't know what they actually look like. Um, and it's the same sort of thing, because you guys have just heard the voice, and now you see the face, and it's never going to match up with what you guys think, because you all think I look different to each of you. If that makes sense, because you've just heard the voice, you've all got a different interpretation of me. I'm nervous. I'm nervous of being judged, and... Oh, it's... It, yeah, I'm, I'm nervous. <laughs> uh, Duncan asks, why aren't you subscribed to me? Uh, next question, Mr. Little J asks, how often should a small YouTuber like me, uh, 100 to 150 subs, live stream? Now, I'm I quite enjoy live stream. I was subscribed. I was live streaming around that same subscriber mark, and I recommend as much as possible. Live streaming for me is one of the best ways to interact with your viewers um, and just people who subscribe to you and just you know share, have fun with them, hang out with them every night. It's what I'm doing at the moment. I've been live streaming all this week. I've been absolutely loving it. So yeah, I definitely recommend live stream as much as you can because that way you know you can interact with your viewers in the comments of your videos but in on live streams you can interact with them live talk to them face to face not face to face but you know what i mean you can talk to them live on the point um as they're talking in chat so i definitely recommend just live stream as much as you can whenever you get free time live stream definitely recommend it ariana plays yt asks will you ever go to conventions like minecon or vidcon so I'm actually going to Insomnia, which is called I60 here in the UK. Um, it's a week on Sunday, like I said, I think it's the 5th of April. I probably should check that date, that's why I've mentioned it in this video. But yeah, I'm going down there with Neutron. So if any of you guys are going to I60, Insomnia 60, um, on the 15th of April, which I believe is the Saturday, that's when I'll be going down. Um, then make sure, let me know, hit me up on Twitter, and potentially come up to me, come and say hi to me and Neutron, because I'm going down with Neutron Gaming. Um, you guys know Neutron. I'm going to be recording some cool stuff there. We're going to be vlogging it all for you guys. So if you're not going, you're still going to get to see the vlog. But definitely, I was actually going to go to Minecon uh, when it was in London. But yeah, it's definitely stuff like VidCon. I do kind of want to go to VidCon, um, but we'll just have to wait and see. Uh, Mr. Little J asks, is green a creative colour? Um... Uh, I'd say so. So, Mr. Random Gamer asks, what are your favourite games? So, uh, my favourite games I have at the moment, if we have a look, I'd say uh, Call of Duty. I'm a massive fan of Call of Duty. Just not the uh, not not the top half, that bottom bit. <laughs> Modern Warfare Remastered, big props to that. Prop Hunt's actually out on that moment. I've not had a chance to play that yet. I can't seem to find it. Um, but also another game I really enjoy, uh, Ratchet & Clank. Absolutely amazing game. If you've never played the original Ratchet & Clank, I definitely recommend it. Um, I loved them when I was growing up um, and they brought out a remastered version of a film so uh, I went and got the game and I'm absolutely loving it. I streamed it a while ago I'm about halfway through the game. Again another card I really enjoy is Black Ops 3. Big fan of Black Ops 3 and the actual Black Ops franchise in general. Uh, Black, Ops was, uh, Black Ops 1 was actually my first Call of Duty um, and that's probably my favourite um, but I don't have it on PS4 because it's not out on there but um, yeah if we go back back uh, 
first card I got was Black Ops 1, and then I did play Modern Warfare 2 on other people's, um, what you call it, consoles and stuff, but I was a bit, a bit too young to own it at that point. Also, I really enjoy GTA, it's in my PS4 right now, I've got it on PC, Xbox, I've got it everything, I really enjoy playing GTA and playing Heist, they're always good, and of course, I love Minecraft, Minecraft's the main game I play all the seven, pretty much every single day, and I really enjoy making redstone creations in it and things like that, and live streaming it and playing mini games with you guys. So, Guardian asks, what was your childhood game? So, this kind of links into what we are just talking about there, uh, Minecraft kind of was a childhood game a little bit, I played that pretty much all throughout my end of my childhood, um, but when I was younger it was stuff like Rayman, if any of you guys know what Rayman is on the PS1, uh, Crash Bandicoot massive, and the game's actually Crash Bandicoot's coming out, again they're making a remastered copy so I'm definitely going to get a hold of that, and we'll probably stream it here on the channel, you guys can come join and have some fun with that, definitely recommend if you've never played the Crash Bandicoot, Bandicoot games, Go and get them. I'm sure you. I think you can get them off the PlayStation Store, and for pretty cheap now. The original games, I really recommend it. They are absolute brilliant platforms, and of course Mario and all that on the Wii and uh, things like that on DS. Yeah. So Chicken Mandy has top three favorite pizza toppings. So I'm gonna have to go for. I'm a big fan of ham, um, and a big fan of chicken, and probably bacon. When I go for Domino's, I usually go. Uh, for the uh, barbecue one, I can't remember what's on it, I think it's chicken, bacon and barbecue sauce, absolutely love that, so good, I had that last night actually. So Mr. Little J asks, what's your favourite Minecraft mini game? So I think I've said this before, but like, that's my doorbell. So I think I've answered this before, but I think my favourite Minecraft mini game has to be Turf Wars on Mineplex, I absolutely love that game, it used to be uh, one in the quiver, um, but then I got really bad at it, but um, it's all good now. Um, I really enjoy playing Turf Wars. I enjoy when you know when you've got your bow and you're firing and you get someone really far away and you get to hear that satisfying ding. Oh, it's good. So Sebastian asks, what do you plan on doing when your channel becomes very popular? So one, thank you very much for saying you thinking my channel will become very popular, but um, I don't really know. Probably just exactly the same as what we're doing right now. I mean, I like I said, I think I answered this question early on. I really enjoy live stream, really enjoy making redstone tutorials, and I'm starting to enjoy doing stuff like this, uh, talking to the camera. So it should be quite good, and um, we'll, we'll have to see where it goes. Loki asks, what made you do YouTube, and any tips for anyone about to start YouTube? Okay, so what made me start YouTube? YouTube was, um, I had an old channel while like, I just enjoyed watching people uh, make content, I just thought it was cool than playing games and being able to upload it, um, and I think some of my favourite YouTubers probably like for now, like Minecraft wise, uh, probably Mumbo Jumbo, that's what inspired me to start this channel, and um, this one here. Um, with the redstone tutorials, that's why my whole channel's based around redstone because it was him that inspired me uh, to make the, the redstone tutorials. And then now more like YouTubers I watch probably uh, Syndicate. Uh, if you don't know Syndicate, make sure you go check him out. He's awesome. Uh, Life of Tommy doesn't know he vlogs a lot. I really enjoy his content. I think he's a great content creator. Um, and any tips about anyone starting YouTube? Well. My main tip is you don't need a lot for if you're going to start YouTube. Um, literally, just start with what you have. Just use what you have. Everything I use is free. I use um, OBS Studio to record the footage. I use DaVinci Resolve, which is a free editing software. It's extremely good. Definitely, definitely recommend it. And it's all free. Everything I use, I'm using Audacity right now, which is free to record the uh, audio. Um, and everything I've just got, I've got this mic here, which I actually won uh, the money for this mic in the game. Uh, game of bingo so <laughs> I wanted a game of bingo and I thought hey what let's treat channel to mic but definitely the mic I used to start off with the channel um, I just had because I used it on my PS4 and it was absolutely brilliant not PS4 on uh, Xbox 360 sorry I used it on that so definitely like I said you can just use whatever you have and then upgrade from there but um, definitely we're getting started just use what you have get it all together it's like I've got this camera um, so I thought I'd use this camera to do vlogs right now not vlogs, this, this uh, Q&A, but that's what I mean, I've got it, um, so I thought I'd just use it, because just use whatever resources you have, and that, that'll that just work from there, and build your channel up, and uh, that's the best advice I can give for anyone that wants to start YouTube. So, Tofu asks, make a simple paragraph or story about chicken. Somehow, these Q&As always end up with chicken. I, I don't know how, but anyway, here we go. So, why did the chicken cross the road?
I don't know, you guys finish it. Let me know in the comments what you think. Tell us the answer to that. We'll see what you guys can come up with. So it's us again Ask what kind of phone do you have? I can't find my phone. Where's the phone? There it is. <laughs> so the kind of phone I have is I have an iPhone 6 right now. I definitely recommend it. It's a great phone. I use it a lot. And before I used to use an iPhone 5. Uh, it's us again also asked how are your day going? Uh, my day is going pretty good right now. I'm enjoying uh, with this new form of content with the face cam. And I hope you guys again like my face. Please don't judge. Please. So Inferno Side asks, do you have a job? Do you have any plans for other games? And what are your favorite part of YouTube slash favorite time as a YouTuber? Okay, so the job thing's quite funny because I was actually meant to be working tonight, but they said they don't need me tonight. So now we're recording the Q&A tonight. So hopefully you guys are going to see the face reveal tonight because I'll be able to edit it and get it out for you guys a day early. So that's absolutely brilliant. Um, but yeah, I work as like a waiter, like team leader sort of thing. Um, so that's what I do as a job. Uh, do you have any plans uh, for other games? I said earlier in the, the uh, q and uh, definitely I really want to get the new Crash Bandicoot game that's coming out. I really want to stream that, things like that. And like I said, COD and stuff like that. If I'm, if I'm ever going to play other games, it'll be when I'm live streaming. Um, but videos will be primarily uh, Minecraft. Um, and what's your favourite part of YouTube and favourite time as a YouTuber? Now I think the favourite time as a YouTuber is probably going to be the, bay, the uh, bit you saw at the start of the video when we hit 1k. Probably my favourite time. I can't thank you guys enough. Thank you so much. Um, and then also when we hit uh, when we were that 200 subscribers stream as well, and we got to 300 subscribers in it. I absolutely love that stream as well. And I think just live streaming in general, I really enjoy just talking to my subscribers and viewers. It's absolutely awesome. Just interacting every single night at the moment. It's really cool. Um, and that's probably my favourite part of YouTube. I'm favourite time mashed together into one. Furnace I ask, can you notice me because I need the attention? Don't worry, I noticed you. So Josh asked, will you ever come to America and have a meet and greet so we can meet you in person? Hashtag Elite Squad. I love in the hashtag there. Um, but yeah, definitely, I really want to go to America at some point. I really want to go to Florida um, and go like Disney Disney World and all that and go on all the rides and things like that. So definitely, if I'm over in America, potentially that's something to sort out. That'd be pretty cool. Maybe in the future though. So Nickname asks, what's your favourite food? Now this links in with the person who asked me about the pizza toppings earlier. Definitely pizza is my favourite food. Like I said, I had a Domino's last night, chicken, bacon, barbecue sauce. <sighs> so good. So Guardian asks, how does it feel to be at four digits? Now this is quite a funny thing because I was talking about it in the live stream yesterday. But I'll tell the story again. And uh, when I went from being nine to ten, my parents said, Oh, it all all changes when you go to ten. When you go double digits, it goes very weird, like you feel different. <laughs> and I believed them the night before. I remember stood next to my bed thinking, oh my gosh. I'm going to be 10 tomorrow, that's double digits, what's going to happen? I'm getting really nervous about it. And four digits, it's insane. And now when I'm live streaming, I'm looking over and it's a thousand and so subscribers. It's just insane. And again, thank you very much, guys. It's one of the best feelings in the world. Marvin asks, how long have you been playing Minecraft? So I've been playing Minecraft now since about 2012, which is when it came out on Xbox 360. I know I didn't join in the alpha and all that on PC, but yeah, I started playing when it came out on 360. Loved it then, and then I got it on PC about half a year later and playing with some of my friends. And now I've been playing on PC ever since. And I mean, I think I've got it on PS3, PS4. Xbox 360, Xbox One, uh, and PC. So yeah, I've, I've, I've bought Minecraft a lot of times. So Marvin asks, what's your favorite chips? So Marvin, here in the UK, we call them Chris. I think my favorite flavors are, um, these are my two favorite flavors probably. I think uh, probably prawn cocktails, my second favorite. Um, I really like them, um, but some are a little bit tingly on the tongue sometimes, but definitely cheese and onion are my number one, but they, they make your breath smell a little bit. That's the only problem with them. So Muffins asks, why isn't chocolate a vegetable? If it comes from beans and beans are a vegetable, then why is it not a vegetable? That is, um, that's a deep question, that. I mean, Google's probably got the answer. I, I'd give it a Google, to be honest. So the final question is from Edwin, and he says, how are you? And Edwin, I'm doing absolutely amazing, because that is it. We've now finished all 30 odd plus questions that you guys have sent in for this face reveal q and I hope you have enjoyed it. I've really enjoyed doing this. I hope the camera cell looks good. I hope you guys don't mind my face. I hope it matches what you guys uh, thought I looked like. It probably won't um, but um, I, I I tried, <laughs> but anyway guys, that is going to be it for this video, guys, let me know down in the comments if you enjoy this, if you enjoy this kind of content, let me know, and we'll see where the channel goes, because like I said, I'm quite enjoying with this camera setup we've got here, and let me know what it looks like, let you know if any improvements, any constructive criticism, I will take it all on board, but that's going to be it for this video, guys, I hope you have enjoyed it, if you did, please like, subscribe, and everything else goes along with it, and I'll see you guys next time, bye!